Good morning to you and welcome to the Wednesday Shave, Midweek Shave. Thank you Mrs H. Um, someone asked through a message somewhere about that shelving unit. It's called a sheet, um, a chic something. Mrs H bought it. Um, it wasn't from a shop you can go to, it was online somewhere. Um, shabby chic, I can't remember, something like that, or French or something. Um, and she couldn't remember the website she's had it from, so uh, maybe pause the video, take a still picture and <laughs> search. I don't know. But anyway, sorry I can't answer it fully. So, welcome to the shave. How are you doing? I hope you're okay. Um, we're having a, a rather basic, back to basics. You don't see lots of people using these a lot. Um, and maybe they're afraid to use them too much in videos but uh, I'm not I'll use anything and this is the Arco shave stick I keep in this uh, this is a 3d printed I've shown it before um, shave stick I bought on Etsy I think it was they do this one and they do one for Derby um, I'm sure they do one for Pam Olive if you ask them maybe I don't know but if I can find the link I'll put the website in the description so simply Take the lid off and if you look underneath that there, that's holding the stick in. But if there's no, I'll show you, take the soap out. If you look in there now, this thing flip. So when you, how can I say, see, it's like a disc which falls out. <laughs> Serves me right. I'll just dry that because I don't want the soap to be too wet. Not, but I do split it anyway. So that's just, a, it's like a pivot and it uh, goes on here. And it sort of rides up and down as you twist. Serves me right, I'm trying to be clever, right. And that is a genuine Arco stick, if you can see that. It does say Arco. I can't remember which way it was now. So there it is, so we'll bring it up to about there. Razor is going to be this. Now, first glance you might think, oh, is this Gillette? Uh, Black Beauty, but it's a Parker 96R. Uh, it's non-adjustable, but it looks adjustable with that, doesn't it? But with this razor, it's, it's funny really, you hold... If I twist this top, watch what happens. I can do it. The whole thing turns. So the way I do it, is you hold that still and twist the handle. And it's the whole handle that turns. Um, just a little, you know, normally that's an adjuster, isn't it? But normally you would turn that and it would open the doors on a lot of razors. But uh, just a little feature with this one. The God, I'm going on. The Gillette Nasset Stainless today, brand new. Oh, There's a brand new box as well. And that is here. Place that in there, like so. See, I'm forgetting myself. There you go. The only thing I've ever said that is overhand to be aware of with Parker razors is always make sure they're still tight uh, as you use them, because some of them can work loose. But they're a good razor, to be fair. Right, we'll wet. No, we won't. We'll... Yes, we will, because we're la lathering with a stick. I'm here. We need a shave. So we'll wet the face. I'm using a, a new moisture cream, moisturising cream I found in uh, Boots the Chemist. It's not a new brand, it's a very old brand, I love this brand, but I haven't had this version of it. I'll show you in a bit. So here we go, we're going to use this. I 
I mean, you can take it out of this if you want, but I like, like, to, like to use it. Well, that's a little wet the face, because... And we're going to use the uh, horse hair brush today. And the reason I'm not dipping this is because it would fall out. That should be more than enough there. So I'll leave that for now. This is the horse hair brush. This is the what was the name of the. Um, Ever ready, that's it. Ever ready 150 handle, and uh, it was kindly re knotted for me and sent to me a horsehair brush. Never tried one, as I said before. I was always worried that they were itchy, scratchy things, but uh, it turns out it's one of the softest brushes <laughs> you could wish for. So, there we go. It's wet or it's damp. We will be adding more water in a So how is your week going? Good I hope. Life is treating you well. So we'll just heat up the Parker 96R. Here we go. Gillette Nasset brand new. First pass. Good slickness, you know, Arco. I've heard some people say that they found they could never, never, ne never lather this up and it wasn't slick. Um, so it must be their water, you know, the water here is soft. So I think they were a hard water place, but then again I have seen people saying, I've got hard water and it lathers up lovely, so I don't know. You never know, do you? Uh, Can be different for different people. Unless they're not using enough soap. Lots of whiskers there. Ooh. That's lovely. Aggression, I'd say it's slightly above a medium, average, standard, whatever you want to call it, just slightly above. It feels very nice. Clean the sink, that's it. Yeah, that's nice. Standard scent for our coat. We can always go back. We're using a horse hair here, so. 
might be similar to a ball brush in there. Regards lather, you can see it's much thinner than this one. So we will have to go back to the pack for the third one because it's sort of it eats it up somehow. It's uh, like a very much like a ball brush, you know. So here we go. Across the room. And to be fair, I haven't soaked the brush this time. That may have helped it a bit, but... Uh... As in the, the lather, you know. That's lovely. Well, what I find with the Parkers is because it's such a, it's quite a thin metal, isn't it? It's quite singy, quite tinny sounding when you, um, it can sound what they what you class as cheap, but uh, they've always served me well, these are inexpensive. Well, they used to be, um, but they work well if you look after them, like anything really. So we're just, we're just gonna hit it over I would think the old uh, synthetic would have been good enough for the sort of whole shave really, but uh, as I say, just wet that. There you go. Any uh, shaves? Any new gear? Are you waiting for anything? Against the growth. That's lovely. Scent strength, mm, about a four out of ten. I tell you what's nice, if you lather like this and then add um, Arco shaving cream from the can, if you have it, just a bit and it really, oof. Gives you thick, creamy lather, as this does if you lather it up properly, and especially with a synthetic. But um, it's just something different using the kind of Arco shaving cream.
treated myself yesterday evening I was um, well last night I should say I didn't have any sort of dinner at uh, or tea whatever you call it tea around five or six o'clock So um, Mrs. A asked me, what would you like? She was in uh, Lidl, I think, or Lidl. And, uh, oh, I said, get me a pizza, please. Pepperoni. So I had that. With some hot sauce. And it was delicious. Change. Three, two, one. Pick up time baby. And this should be enough. Yeah, no waste in this. In fact, I I like going back to the puck because because you feel like you're really using the soap, you know. And it's quite plentiful. And I got some Derby there, I must use them. Use them, you know. Beautiful. Oh yeah. So cold water rinse. Wake me up rinse. Whew. Do you mind? Thank you. Very happy with that. So I'm going to use a bit of homemade, which I only done sort of half a bottle, and um, mentholated, using the frost drops from um, Sterling. Yeah, lovely. Not strong. It's not a, an eye closer. And then we're going to use an old classic. Now, if you've cut yourself and you start using this cologne, you're going to start screaming, baby. <laughs> it's quite a high. I'm going to use the Arco. This is the uh, the uh, Gold Power. Gold Power. I think it's meant to be a close copy of the is it one million by um oh, i forgot the name now you know the one i mean the one million so i believe oh yeah it is because um i've had some of that the one million that's good actually but this won't last as long as the genuine stuff yet. But it's good. Not a as I say you can get a sting, but nothing on this 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 time because there's no sort of nicks or anything, so that's lovely. Have a sniff of that. Now this is the new stuff, Astral. Um I love this stuff. Uh, it's British made and it's one I've not had myself before, and it's the Intensive Moisturiser with Cocoa Butter. Hence this sort of 
little pinky, creamy, caramel coloured, whatever it is, stripe there. So, and there it is. I'll take that peak. Take the glasses off. Yeah, so there's a hint of cocoa, coconut, you know, that type of thing. Very mild though. That is nice. You have to work it in. Good stuff, strong stuff. As I say, you will have, you will shine for a bit, especially when you're filming lights. But that will die down, you know, in oh, well, 10 minutes. Or something like that. It'll be absorbed. That's lovely. So I'm glad I got that. And I noticed in Boots the Chemist, they sell this, they sell the standard, and they sell, sell a big, big one of that. But um, I did contain myself <laughs> from buying it. So we've used the Parker, quite a sort of basic, inexpensive shave really. The Parker 96R, a um, bit like the Gillette. Uh, Black Beauty, um, that looks like an adjuster, but it's not, it's, it's non-adjustable. As I say, you just twist the, if I can grip it, i got cream on my hands now. There you go. Twist to open, and we've used this uh, Gillette Nasset, brand new, lovely blade. Um, this particular blade in this razor felt, as I say, just above what I class as a standard mid-aggression. Just above it, lovely. We've used the Everready 150 handle with a horse hair knot, very soft. Sorry, I didn't get one of these years ago. Uh, it did eat up the Arco this time, so I had to add a bit more, but that's no problem. Very slick the Arco in the shave stick here. So the only thing with this is you can use it like that, you can store the stick, but if you turn it upside down, it will come out. Um, there's no spikes in the bottom, which I'm glad really, because I'm going to take this apart anyway to dry it uh, for the soaps reason. And uh, this is, like I say, it's a 3D um, prints, printed um, shave stick holder. Really nice, I like that. It goes part of a collection. Um, Gillette Nasser, yeah. Water to rinse, then we've used the Arco Gold Power Cologne. Really nice, smells nice. And um, we've used the homemade sort of mentholated witch hazel on me and then this new purchase for me the astral uh, intensive moisturizer with cocoa butter very nice so i'll leave you in peace i shall babble no more and i'll see you on sunday for the weekend shave and these coming quick these <laughs> these shaves uh, maybe i should go to once a week filming them because uh, you won't see me as much then maybe but uh, i enjoy doing them so thanks for watching thanks for your support have a great rest of the week, stay safe and bye bye.